What do you love, Nick? What I really love uh, is hanging out with my family, watching TV, movies, and cartoons. And one of the interesting aspects about cartoons of Chucky and Kimmy as boyfriend and girlfriend, mm -hmm. you know, they like to uh, sleep together, go to a movie together. They like to sleep together? Yep, that's what I use my imagination for. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm going to ask you the question again. Go for it. And then I want you to give this answer. And okay. I guarantee everybody is going to go, oh. Sure. Okay, well, now I ask you, what do you love? You're going to say, I love Jessica. Okay. Okay, so Nick, let me ask you a question. What, what, do, you, what do you love? I love Jessica because she's my girlfriend. Uh huh. <laughs> See? That was good. Hi, what's your name? Um, Nathan. Nathan, as you know, you have to pitch your story and I have to approve it. Go ahead with the pitch. What's your story about? The story is about this old man. Um, Why'd you look at me when you said old man? No offense. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this old man, and it's not you, <laughs> has this um, nurse so this problem that he keeps them falling asleep, and he tries to rob this rich person named Richie. And okay, so he's like a bumbling kind of robber that uh, he's a narcole narcolepsy? And he falls asleep just as he's about to rob. Yes. Okay. Okay, so what happens after that? What, what happens to the end that um, um, the old man, I think Lester is his Lenny. name? Lenny. Um, he pretty much realizes that Richie isn't much of a bad person. And he either... Um, I think either Richie gives him a job at the end, or he pretty much um, gets a cure whenever um, for the nar narcolepsy. narcolepsy. So yes. he can they rob without sleeping? But why does he, he rob? Is, because he's poor and pretty much je jealous of Richie with his fortunes. Okay, I got and you. He realizes that Richie is... Is actually a nice person. And where does this all take place? The library. The library. That's always a good location, the library. All right. And so what's the lesson learned on this? What was it? What did you say the lesson was? Um, Lenny um, realizes that Reggie isn't a bad person and he shouldn't be robbing. Well, I like that. I like that he's a philanthropic guy and realizes that he's robbing a really good guy. Yeah. Okay. I like that. Yes. What are you going to say? You have to try to avoid... Avoid this guy named Frank West, who's Richie's publicist. Oh, who's photojournalist? Okay, so there's a story being done about Richie and how his good works. Okay, okay. Well, now I get it. I get it. Okay, guys. Um, Jared, what do you think? Do you like it? It's up to you whether we're going to do it. So I'm going to, by proxy, I'm going to give you my vote to do it. Thumbs up or thumbs down? Okay, thumbs up. You're approved, guys. Good luck. My big concern is, I don't know whether you're in on this, Jack. Are you in? On this film, I am. Okay, because I, I, the whole time that the pitch was going on, I was a little concerned. You, you looked a little preoccupied. Are you worried about the baseball game today or something? No. Okay, you could have fooled me. All right, what message do you have for the whole world? If you could talk to the whole world, what would your message be? Uh, probably be help each other out. Please recycle.